Hi, I'm Dr. Sue Hamilton with the University of Tennessee Gardens, and I'm standing in front of a large, beautiful forsythia, which is just a fabulous shrub to welcome in spring. It's the, usually the first flowering shrub, and you know spring is, is on the way. I wanted to talk to you about pruning uh, forsythia because I think nothing's prettier than when forsythia is left to its natural form. You can see we've got a pretty large specimen here, and if you ever feel like you want to knock it back some, control its growth, rather than using hedge clippers where you cut it into a little ball or a square and all the branches are the same height, I recommend that you use like loppers or hand pruners to selectively choose and remove branches that uh, are too big but still will give you that natural look. And as an example, I'm going to take like this branch here. If I were to just go in and cut this back right above a bud, cut that out. The nice thing is I've already I've reduced that height in there, but it's, it doesn't stick out. It, it still looks like it's in a, its very natural form. So that's the way I recommend you do any size forsythia that you have in your landscape.